All right, y'all. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to do this really simple hairstyle that is, it looks complex, but it's really easy to do at home. So stay tuned for this video. Hey Galaxy Girls! Thank you so much for tuning in to yet another hair tutorial. If you are a loyal subscriber to my channel, I want to thank you because y'all really do keep this channel alive and thriving. All right. So sponsoring this video today, we have AF Sister Wig, AF Sister Wig. So they sent us a 13 by 6 lace front unit, bone straight. All right. I love this unit because it was really thick. It was just really full. I think it was a maybe like a 200 or a 250% density. I really, really like getting thick quality wigs. Every time I get a full wig, I let y'all know because I don't always get the same type of wigs, okay? Sometimes they look good on camera, but they're not always really full in person. But this one from F Sister Wig is definitely full really really soft and the lace was really thin and flexible meaning that it can let i mean it can it can melt really easy <laughs> so sitting in my chair today um i have my girl chloe now chloe is a i mean i'm not gonna say she's a baby wig wearer because i've been installing wigs on her for maybe like two years now i think maybe going on two years, maybe like a little bit over a year, but she is fresh to wearing wigs. But ever since I did the first lace front on her, she's been getting them consistently ever since. And I'm so proud of her. Cause I'm like, I would have never expected her to become like a wig girly, you know, <laughs> her hair, her natural hair is so long and full and curly. So Listen, she has really long, beautiful hair underneath this wig, as y'all seen in the beginning of the video. So yeah, so this wig is already looking really, really nice. Um, I know the camera looks kind of blurry. It looks like we smoked the whole room out, <laughs> but we didn't. I don't know why it looks like that, so don't mind the camera. But yeah, so as y'all can see, the lace is really, really just thin, and it's like, I don't know if it's HD lace. I know it's not a transparent lace. I'm not sure, but it just blended in really, really nice. And I barely did anything to it. I don't even think I put any makeup on it. So yeah, it's already looking really, really natural. And it's literally growing out her skin. <laughs> like girl, this is literally growing out her skin. So, <laughs> so now I'm separating the baby hair so it can get out of my way when I do this braid. And you know, we were thinking what hairstyle to do. Like every time I ask her, what hairstyle do you want? She literally looks at me and says, you know, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> like that's your decision, not mine. So every time I do her hair, I have to use a little bit of like creativity because I don't want to just send her out of my chair looking the same way every time. I want to, you know, do some do some nuance a little bit change it up a little bit but i don't want to make it so like complex where she can't maintain it right so with this i just did a side part and a braid and i felt like the braid was going to be cute enough to where it looks like a hairstyle hairstyle you know but it's easy enough to maintain to where she doesn't have to do anything to it except put a scarf on and just don't mess it up <laughs> So right now I'm doing this braid like I'm a braider. Um, <laughs> I don't know where this is coming from, <laughs> but honey, this braid looks like I like been braiding for 20 years straight. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know. It just looks good. <laughs> like sometimes when I do braids, they're average and sometimes I do them and they look amazing. And today just happens to be one of those amazing days. <laughs> The braid guides were really on my side today. So thank you for that. 
so now I'm taking the gel and I'm molding her baby hairs and you know sometimes I'll use the foam on the baby hairs but because I want this hairstyle to be as low maintenance as possible for her I'm just using gel you know like whenever you want your baby hairs to stay in one place and not move for like 10 days straight just use the foam I mean <clears throat> what am I talking about <laughs> just use the gel so on the sideburns i'm using the foam because it helps the curl mold a little bit easier sometimes when you use the gel and you try to keep that curl on the sideburn or on the baby hairs it is so heavy that it kind of prevents the hair from curling so i'll use the gel like at the top of the swoop and i'll use foam at the bottom just so it can you know swoop right so yes ma'am baby hairs are laid the hairline is glued down and secured and now i'm gonna sit her under the dryer and boop now she's out all right so <laughs> so now i'm going to comb this out oh my gosh it, it's looking so laid uh, like girl laid okay if i ain't seen a, la a laid wig in my life i seen one today okay all right, so now that this is looking like, girl, first day of school, good. <laughs> now I'm going to put some of my Galaxy Girl wax stick on there so I can make sure I have a little bit of moisture on there. So when I put this hot comb to it, baby, them flyaways are laid, okay? They ain't flying away nowhere. So now I'm going to, you know, just make it nice and flat and i'm using my hot pink comb from galaxygirlhair.com so listen baby after you get your wig from appsisterwig.com head to galaxy girl and get your wax stick your pink hot comb your liquid lace glue your melting spray all that all that we got everything you need to melt your wig properly at home all right so yep i'm taking my hot comb and just making the hairline nice and flat all the way around so it just looks like a fresh perm y'all could y'all imagine y'all hair like what if y'all's natural hair was this long like what if your natural hair was like 30 inches long <laughs> and when you flat ironed it it looked just like this that would be crazy that would be crazy all right <laughs> all right so everything is looking really really nice and you see the wig was already kind of like bone straight out the box so i don't have to go row by row and you know be extra tedious when hot i mean when flat ironing her hair because the wig was already like straight so this is definitely a good quality wig i can tell that even if it's like moist outside or if she gets caught in some humidity that it's not gonna get like poofy or anything because it was already like really really straight to the point where all i had to do was take my hot comb why do i keep saying that all i had to do was take my flat iron and just run through it i didn't even have to do too much to it to make it bone straight so uh listen we did the damn thing okay if you guys want this exact wig you already know i'm gonna put all the information in the description below there's also some discount codes on there so y'all can save some moolah okay period don't forget the discount codes and if you are not subscribed to my channel already make sure you go ahead and do that turn on your notifications and i'll see y'all in the next video and tell me if you like this hairstyle and if you'll try it at home on yourself maybe with a wig or even your natural hair